TGIT, thank goodness it is Thursday tonight. We have a magnificent game between the Houston Texans and the Indianapolis Colts. Houston has nothing to play for tonight, really. They won their division. They are most likely going to get that third seed and thus play the worst wildcard team. The Indianapolis Colts. Well, they, they got something to play for because they won last week and now they're at risk of not getting Andrew Luck. Now, I, I don't think the Indianapolis Colts are going to intentionally lose to get Andrew Luck, no. And I, I don't see the Texans uh, just saying, you know what, we don't need to go out there and play hard. we got a playoff spot. Let's just uh, be wussies out there. No, no, that's not going to happen either. But I do have a system that I like using, that is, whenever a really, really bad team wins outright, you want to fade them the week following, and whenever a good team loses outright, you want to play them the week following. So we got both situations here. Not, not so huge with Houston because Yates, but Indianapolis, yes. There's a winless team that goes 0-13 uh, and then wins a game 1-13. Now only a game ahead of St. Louis and Minnesota for the last draft pick, first draft pick, which is Losing is winning in that spot. And we have a spread of only six and a half points. I'm going to be laying six and a half on the Houston Texans as we have a situation of a really, really bad team in Indianapolis against a good rush defense. I don't think Donald Brown's going to play too, too well, but I think it's important to see what he can do as they try to figure out the running back of the future. Joseph Adai is just terrible. So we'll see how Donald Brown works. So for the Houston side of the ball, Expect a lot of Arian Foster and Ben Tate. And it also should be a game where TJ Yates could, should be able to develop a couple nice passes. Although I still wouldn't start him in any fantasy league. Arian Foster, if you even sat him any week this week, I don't know what to say. But he should be going off really, really big for this particular game tonight. I want to get back on, uh, do some uh, more uh, look at the games on Friday. Especially the 1 o'clock games between the Denver Broncos and the Buffalo Bills, as well as the Kansas City Chiefs and the Oakland Raiders. Thank you for tuning in and have yourself a great day. Bye-bye.